Hello, my name is Laxon. I'm your dead instructor. Welcome to this short lesson on how to create your first Flutter mobile application. In this tutorial, we'll be creating a simple default Flutter mobile app using the command Flutter create and the name of our application. So before we begin, you will need your Flutter environment set up. If it's not, please watch the previous lesson. Uh, watch the previous lesson that talks about how to install Flutter on your machine. So now that we have that out of the way, we can start with today's lesson. Okay, that was my internet. So uh, first things first, we have to select uh, where we want to store our app. So we'll just go here, what's the thing? Open folder, so I'm already like in the directory that I want to to store my app, which I want to store it here, where it's PLP projects. I'm sure you guys you can store it anywhere you want. So after that, selected the folder. So what uh, the next thing for the, the next thing is um, we have to uh, open in terminal. Okay, now that our terminal is up and running. So what we can do is we're supposed to enter Flutter, create, then the name of application. So we're gonna name this one demo app. I don't even know why I want to name it demo app, but yeah, it's demo app. So we just hit enter and we wait for it to create everything for us. Okay, now it's done. So we can just sit into the directory. So it's demo up. You can clear the screen. Um, okay, so from here I can even expand this uh, this folder so that uh, everything here. Don't worry, I'll explain it in the next video. For now, I just want you guys to concentrate on this folder that's called lib. So in here, this is where you'll be putting all your dat files. Whatever that uh, file that you'll be uh, creating, this is where your files will be. So uh, for now, we only have one. So this is the, the dat file, it's called main. So this is the main file. This is the main file that um, starts the application. And this is where the main function is. This is the main function as you can see here. So now for us to, for us to run this application, this uh, Flutter demo application, what we're supposed to do, we're supposed to start an emulator that will show us uh, the application, something that we'll be using for us to see what we, what we are doing. So we have to start um, an Android uh, uh, emulator. So from here, we're going to go where it's saying Windows. Some of you guys, I'm sure it will be showing Chrome or something. So you can click here, then you select the emulator that you created in the previous video. In this video, I'm going to use this emulator because it boots fast and I don't want to waste much of your time. So let's wait for the emulator to start. So I'm going to minimize this so that we can have both uh, windows on the screen. We can have our VS Code window and we can also have our emulator by the side here. So if you guys can see, my screen is small. So yeah. So let's just wait for the for the emulator to start.
Okay, now that our emulator is up and running, so what we're supposed to do, we're supposed to run this. You can use this here, that's showing here, or you can use up there, where you're saying uh, run or start, but we're gonna just click it anyway. We're just gonna use this one here. Yeah. So we wait for the, uh, for Flutter to generate an APK and install it. On our emulator, so let's just wait. Okay, now that our app is running, let's test it. So what this app is all about is uh, it's, a, it's a counter app. So whenever you, I would say click or press uh, this uh, button, the plus button, it to increment the value here where it's showing zero. So you have pushed the buttons this many times, as you can see here, so it to tell you how many times you have uh, pushed the, this button here. So if I do this, uh, okay, it will increment to one. If I press it again, it will increment to two. If I press it again, it will increment to three. Just like that, it will continue doing that. So it's a simple application. And uh, this application was uh, created only using this code here, as you can see here, here, this file. So with uh, big applications, of course, you're gonna create more dot files, of which I'm gonna, uh, along this, um, Later on, you guys, you're going to learn how to do that, how to create uh, beautiful applications. But for today, or in this lesson, you have learned how to create a simple Flutter mobile application. Congratulations, and you can test this on your machine. If you're receiving any errors, don't hesitate. You can just contact us, you can contact uh, uh, the instructors, you can contact me, myself, Laxon, you can contact Alan, or you can contact Joseph. Thank you for watching this uh, video, and see you in the next video.